integrity, passion, professionalism, patriotism. Ubuntu. The philosophy of Ubuntu means humanity. It is reflected in the idea that we affirm our humanity when we affirm the humanity of others. South Africa's unique approach to global issues has found expression in the concept of Ubuntu and informs our particular approach to diplomacy and shapes our vision of a better world for all. On behalf of the Honorable Minister of International Relations and Cooperation, Mayor Maite Mkwaramashabani, welcome to the annual Ubuntu Awards 2016. The Minister of International Relations and Cooperation, Ms. Maite Nguana Mashabane, hosted the annual Ubuntu Awards at the Cape Town International Convention Center on Saturday, 13 February 2016, under the theme, Celebrating Excellence in Diplomacy. The awards are aimed at rewarding organizations or individuals who have, through excellence, innovation, creativity, inventiveness, social responsibility or patriotism, distinguished themselves as true ambassadors of South Africa. The second annual Ubuntu Awards covered eight categories. These are Ubuntu Economic Diplomacy Awards for Africa, Ubuntu Economic Diplomacy Award for Global, Ubuntu Social Responsibility Award, Ubuntu Arts and Cultural Diplomacy Award, Ubuntu Youth Diplomacy Award, Ubuntu Sports Diplomacy Award, Ubuntu Ambassadorial Excellence Award, and the OR Tambo Lifetime Achievement Award. When the idea of the Ubuntu Diplomacy Awards was conceived, we knew exactly what we sought to achieve. These awards serve as one of the platforms that our department uses to implement its vision of creating a better world for all, by recognizing South Africans who fly our country's flag very high on the global stage. His Excellency President Jacob Zuma delivered the keynote address and commended South Africans who had excelled in their respective fields of work. President Zuma said this year's recipients had distinguished themselves in their service to the country. These important awards recognize industry leaders, eminent persons, and extraordinary citizens for their contribution towards making our great country even greater. Today, we honor those who hold our beautiful flag high and who contribute to not only telling but demonstrating the good story of the Republic of South Africa. The men and women that have been honored here today are inspirational examples of this in their various industries, they have truly excelled, thus promoting a positive image of our nation across the globe. Among the winners were Athletics Rising star Wade van Niekerk, who took home the Ubuntu Sports Diplomacy Award. The Ubuntu Arts and Cultural Award went to two South African music heavyweights. Multi-award winning record producer DJ Black Coffee was recognized for his successful career, which has grown since winning a DJ competition in the 1990s to an influential international DJ. Watching him grow from a township boy to an international brand that he is, it's an amazing thing, not only for him, but for other kids who want to achieve the same thing, who are probably in need of hope. World-renowned trumpeter, flugel hornist, band leader, composer and singer, Hugh Masikela was recognized for his immeasurable contribution to arts and culture and to the liberation struggle through song.
If it wasn't for the people of South Africa, I wouldn't be. So, with humble respect, I accept this honorable award on behalf of the people of South Africa. Thank you. The main award of the evening went to struggle stalwarts Agnes Musiman and the late Johnny Makatini, who were both recognized under the O.R. Tambo Lifetime Achievement Award. At age 87, Msimang, who was honored for her excellent contribution in the fight against the unjust laws of apartheid, received the award in person on the Saturday night. Makatini, who died in exile, was honored for his legendary and towering accomplishments which earned him a permanent place in South African diplomatic history. It is truly an honor. We feel so humbled and honored as the Makatini family that this honor has been restored upon Johnny. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. President. In other categories, Standard Bank won the Ubuntu Economic Diplomacy Award for Africa, while Discovery was honored with the Global Award in the same category. Rescue SA and the Mutsepe Foundation shared the Ubuntu Social Responsibility Award for their contribution through corporate social investment initiatives. Former Miss Earth and Lead SA Executive Catherine Konstantinidis walked away with the Ubuntu Youth Diplomacy Award. This award is truly a humbling, humbling experience. This award allows me to continue the work I do. It highlights the work that is not always a focus area. The environment, climate change, greening issues, food security, these are not popular topics. So an award like this honors that kind of work. And I think it allows a platform for us to have discussion and debate around these issues. We see our country devastated by, by water shortages, by drought. These are issues we must, we must address. Ambassador Ben Mpoko from the DRC, who also serves as the Dean of the Diplomatic Corps, won the Ubuntu Ambassadorial Excellence Award. I feel uh, honored by this award. And I have dedicated it to my grandmother because she taught me from a very young age the values of Ubuntu, the meaning of sharing, the meaning of respecting the adults um, and so forth. The language, that, the polite language that one must use when you're addressing those that are older than you. It doesn't matter whether they're poor, they're rich. When you're talking to an adult, you use a different language. My grandmother taught me those values and I have carried those values through my career uh, as a banker, as a diplomat and so forth. So that's why I'm dedicated to the most to her.